Hey what is up guys, Tom Mundy here back with another video for you and today I'm giving you my first impressions on Firefall. Now this isn't a like a review or anything, I want to cover that. This game is still in beta so I'm not going to be like, oh the character creation system shit, oh the crafting system shit, because it's still in beta and everything could change. All I'm going to do is just talk about my experience with the general game, as in how Firefall works, what sort of game it is, and is the general concept of the game fun? Because I doubt this far into development, they're just going to say, okay, scrap the original concept, let's just completely redesign the game. So I'm just going to give you my thoughts on the concept of the game and just how it is. So if you don't know what Firefall is, it's sort of a, uh, what could you say, a mix of Planet Side 2, or well, what you could really say is it's what global agenda should have been. Uh, you know, you can sort of it's that sort of uh, you know third person shooter sort of thing, but you have a like an actual world with regular RPG content in, as in quests, and you know, go out and kill this, go out and collect this, and you know your regular RPG quests. But it's a third person shooter, and you know you queue for PvP, and you know, it's very PvP orientated and such, and it's that sort of game. Yeah, I don't see any other way you could put it. Uh, it actually really surprised me. I was thinking, you know, how are they going to pull off the PVE sort of style in this sort of type of game? It, it is actually quite good. You just kill stuff, you know, you kill monsters uh, in a shooter th form. I don't know why I thought it would have been anything else, but that's how it is. It's it's quite fun. It is quite fun, the PVE. I really enjoyed the PvP, although I really don't like games where it takes, you know, 10 seconds of shooting at someone to kill them. Like People have a lot of health. Because that opens up a very large window for someone to steal your kill. Now, if you get them on low health and then your team just jumps into the fight, there's a good chance that they'll nick your kill. And that did happen to me quite a lot in PvP. I'd be working on someone trying to get them down and uh, they would get stolen from me. But uh, that's one thing. That's like the major issue I had with the game. But like I said, it's still beta. So hopefully that will change. Maybe they'll nerf the health a bit. I don't, you know, but then again, I can't really see this game being that sort of game where you kill someone very quickly in shooter form. It just, it wouldn't really work for the game. But then, it's really annoying to me personally to see how it takes so long to kill someone, and then someone just comes along and steals your kill. Um, so that that did bother me. That did bother me. But yeah, again, this isn't a review. <laughs> PvP was good though. It, it was just uh, I, I I only played team deathmatch. I uh, played some team deathmatch on it, and it was good. Yeah, it was good. I played. I rolled the recon class. It's not like you know you select classes at the start of PvP matches or anything like that. You know you pick a role and then you play that role uh, permanently, unless you create a new character. But uh, as the recon, I just found myself using the sidearm, which is a sort of submachine gun. Uh, I never found myself using the actual sniper because it was shit. It, it didn't kill anything. The the assault rifle would kill things way quicker than the sniper would. So that's definitely something that they should fix. So there's some beta feedback in the form of a video for the developers. They should definitely fix that because it, it, it's really easy for games to make a recon class overpowered. You know, one shot in the face. And, I, you know, and honestly, I think it should be one shot in the head should kill someone. Unless they're a really tanky character, maybe. But, yeah, you know. But then games go for this whole, like, ten shots in the body with a sniper and you know this sort of game people have jetpacks people are bouncing all over the place you're not gonna kill anyone especially when it's still like three to four shots in the head you're not gonna get them three to four times in the head when they're bouncing around like that so that does need to be sorted um, as far as things that you know crafting and that go uh, I don't really know what to say about crafting other than it's just like your typical MMO crafting system you sort of collect things and then choose stuff from a list and then it makes it for you and then you can use that item that's pretty much the best way I can put it. The world is actually pretty nice as well. It's it's really uh, the the art style is weird. It's like cartoony stuff, and it's nice. I like it. It's yeah, I, I like it. I really do like it. Um, it it is it was a bit confusing some quests. I did get really confused on one quest. Uh, although I shouldn't have. Um, it, it spoke as if. Like, this guy was meant to give me an item. It was like, you know, use this guy's items on this. And I was like, okay. Why don't I have his items? Okay, I was just looking everywhere for this, like, item this guy had apparently given me. But it wasn't something that he had given me. It was something that my class actually had. It was a feature of my class. So I, I, I just thought this guy had given me, like, an item that I meant to use. But it was actually just 
something I was meant to do for my class. So that really confused me. Things like that, of course, need fixing. But, it, yeah, again, it's beta. It, all things like that will probably get fixed. So, um... Don't don't take uh, don't don't think less of the game because I'm mentioning these things in this first impressions video. This is just m my impressions of the game and how the game generally works. I'm not gonna say oh I got stuck in this terrain and it was shit. So oh oh this guy this kind of character is like way OP. I'm not gonna say anything like that because it's beta. You know I just want to stress that point. Beta. You know I hate seeing people whinging about stuff in beta. It's it's beta, you know, if enough people uh, give feedback about it, it'll get fixed. And rather than sitting in the general chat whinging, you should be in the report a bug or submit feedback section submitting some feedback or reporting the bug. Um, general PvE difficulty, I did die once in PvE uh, against these, this is like sort of patrols. Uh, it is like drop pod came in, and I'm not sure if actually players come in on that. All I, I went to the drop pod location because it shows up on your HUD. I went to that location and there was a drop pod there and it had drop pod guards. So I don't know if like players actually came out of that drop pod and wandered off and there was just guards there. Or whether it just guards come out to protect the drop pod from doing something, I don't know. But what I did was um, I just sort of killed the guards. I did die once trying to kill them because they were decently tough I guess. I, I was taking on four of them at once. Like one of the f couple of the first few NPCs I'd ever killed, and they're just uh, and I'm going straight for these drop pod NPCs on the other side of the map. I did run like halfway across the map to it, but I thought I might as well check it out. Um, so they killed me once, and then I just killed them. They're just little guard sort of things. You're seeing that. You're seeing that footage now. And uh, then I had to destroy the drop pod, which seemed to have a bit of health, but was no problem. I was sort of praying that no pra players would come. Because it seemed, it did seem the players came out of that drop pod, but I'm really not sure. I, I'd imagine that I'm in the sort of noob area anyway. So, yeah. It's a um, pretty good game. I really like it, but will I be playing it? No. This game is very heavily centralized about playing with friends. And I don't have any friends, so I will not be playing this game. Nah, I'm joking. Um... I do have friends, but none of them will probably play it. I'd be happy to play with any of you guys, though. If you would like to play some uh, Firefall, I'd gladly play with uh, some of you folks. It's a good game. I'd like to play it. It's just like uh, Planet Side 2. I'd like to play it, but I just don't have anyone to play with. So it's it's a bit boring to play on your own. It, goes dry. it gets dry really quickly, as I'd imagine this game would. It would probably get dry really quickly if you didn't have anyone to play with. Just like most MMOs, really. But yeah, I will not be playing it. Unless you guys want to play. But will I be playing it full time? No. I'll probably play it casually. If people want to play. It is free as well. That's worth mentioning. It's free. It's a free game. It's. Uh, I did pay to have like some ex some privileges. So I could have the beta early. It was actually just an open beta weekend. But uh, I didn't participate. I was a bit busy. So. could participate sadly. I did want to. But I bought the game anyway. So I could play it and make some videos. Um, I mean, I'll put up some general PV PvP gameplay. I won't do any PvE stuff. I'm not too interested in PvE, to be honest with you. I won't really be able to talk very well about it. Um, but, yeah, this is my, like, Firefall general gameplay, talking about the game and how it works. And, uh, yeah, I don't really know where I was going with this video. It's just, like, going with the flow sort of thing. Yeah. And, um, yeah. Get, get jetpacks and stuff, yeah. Anyway, yeah, thank you very much for watching, and I probably won't do a video like this again. But, um, yep, yeah, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. Also, leave a comment, leave some feedback. And, uh, yeah, I'll see you in the next video where I will be doing some... What was I going to be doing? I was going to be doing something. I planned to play something. Oh, yeah, that game. Um, ah, oh, never mind. I don't even know. But, yep, yeah, goodbye.